Welcome everybody, TragicMTG here, and I finally got my first Ikoria Collector's Booster Box to go through. Now that it's finally been released, so let's dig in and see if I get any Godzillas out of this thing, among other things, right? So, it's the 15th release day, and uh... Miraculously, I actually got these in the mail because often when I order these online, they come, they re, they ship them on the day they release, and then I don't get them until the next week. So here they are early to open up. Let's see what we got here. Oh, and I was as always, we're gonna scan up. Whoops, not that stuff. Get rid of that. There we go. We're gonna scan up anything that looks extra spicy. See if it can even handle it. There's a Sharknado to start off with. Loving the foils. Got a human soldier on the back of that. Great. So, got some commons. So, there have been a lot of YouTubers out there. Got uh, plenty of these boxes early. So, um, no point in really looking too close here. We've got a Gabby Nest Warden from the Commander set. And a Kinnon non foil. There we go. 273 Mythic there. Let's see. Let's make a, let's make a Mythic pile. There we go. Kinnon Bonder Prodigy. 2183 for the extended art version. Very nice. A foil box topper would have been really sweet for that too. Got a quartz wood crasher. Not gonna really scan that one up here. Yeah, I'll just redo my piles completely. There we go. Cloud Piercer, a glowstone recluse, an Everquill Phoenix, Dorat, the perfect pet, and a gem razor. Very cool. Love the alternate kaiju art on these um, I'm a big comic book fan and uh, stuff like that just really looks awesome to me all the bright colors so foil version of that currently $3.99 so there we go maybe I'll just scan up the mythics and the really big hits here there we go pack number one away how's everyone doing today hopefully you're doing well Anyone get to play with these other than on Arena? I have had, unfortunately, no time to play Arena at all. My, my business is just far too busy right now. Got a Dismantling Wave from Commander. Got a Titan's Nest. That's just a buck. Death's Oasis. There we go. And a Migratory Great Horn. But being 45 cents, the foil probably not much more. We got a Regal Leosaur. Iluna, Apex of Wishes alternate. Very, very cool art. Love that. Not the foil version though. We got a Space Godzilla. Death Corona. I said it. I said it. Come at me, bro. Five bucks for that. So, and of course, this one here um, was the big no no for a while there, but I think the. The price was outrageous. No one should have ever paid $300 for one of these. But here is uh, the current value on the showcase version of that. 20 bucks. And get that sold right away because it's going to probably tank some more. So we'll call that a winner in the winner pile right there. Very cool. What else do we have here? A feather token, nice. All right, the Almighty Brushwag, y'all love that. Got a Sanctuary Blade, so not sure what all uh, cards out of the Commander set are really great, so we'll just put them there. Sky Cat Sovereign, Yadaro, Wandering Monster. There's your your showcase uh, box topper style. There's like so many names for these things now. Yadaro, oh, I can't even see it. It's like too shiny. All right, well. There's that one. It's not getting scanned. A Necro Panther. Got a Boneyard Lurker. A Vadrock. Apex of Thunder. Loving the Mythics here. And a King Caesar. So let's see if that can scan up here. Three bucks there. Mythic Pile. King Caesar. I don't think it's a really big one. There you go. Moving on. Tragic. You missed so many of those to scan. Oh well. It's just going to happen this time. Cat Token. Human Soldier. Scorpion, a phase dolphin, but one of the best kind of dolphins. Tiam, Tam, Luminous Enigma from the uh, Commander set, and there's an otter. 
I don't know. It's not going to pop up. It'll pop up in a second. Lutri the Spell Chaser. Brockos, Apex of Forever. Another foil mythic. Necro Panther. So Brockos as a foil. Um, apparently my Wi-Fi is real slow for my phone right here. That'll pop up. Dreamtail Heron. Cub Warden. Love it. Ah, oh, there's a Bio Quartz Space Godzilla. Look at all the Godzillas I'm getting. That's awesome. So let's see here. Get rid of these. Let's do the Cub Warden. Scanner prices are coming in real slow. Okay, five bucks for Brockos. Cub Warden just 75 cents. A Bio Quartz Space Godzilla, which is the Kaiju version of Brockos Apex of Forever. There. Collect the whole set. There they are. Right? So let's it up 1891 that's a winner all right well got more packs to do mysterious egg it's the most mysterious kind of egg psychic impetus labyrinth raptor cool even the regular art on this one's fine garuda doom adepts in foil migratory great horn cloud piercer ketria triumph there we go so the showcase versions of these, I think, are going to hold some value for quite some time. And we got a Rodan. So Ketria Trium. That in foil would have been pretty nice. 858 for the regular. The piles make sense, trust me. Rodan, Titan of Winged Fury. The alternate of Vadrock. 16, just on its own in that version. Next. Catbird. Always get a human on the other side, it looks like. Fireflux Squad. Commander. Eerie Ultimatum. Pretty nice. That, I like the art on that. Venturer Showcase Style. I'm sorry, Box Topper Style. Whatever. Whatever, you guys. And then, like, since it doesn't have a border, it's hard for the scanner to really see it. It's a buck. The foil might be more. Cavern Whisperer Alternate. That's great. Absolutely love it. Parcel Beast. Vivian. Monsters Advocate. Alternate. Showcase style. Non-foil. And a Destoroy. Why do you say that? Destoroya. Perfect life form. Look how perfect that life form is. That's great. It's a phoenix. Doesn't it look like a phoenix? So Vivian. That's a cool one right there. I think I got this in... Uh, now I got a Narset in Japanese when I got my Japanese box in. I don't know, it, the scanner doesn't like it when they don't have a border sometimes, so. Vivian doesn't get scanned. She's probably like, I don't know, 15 bucks, something like that. And an Archipelago, so Destoroya. The Destoroya. Five bucks there, great. That's exactly where those go. Feel free to count up down below in the comment section how many of these I missed pricing that were worth anything, so. Like I said, feel free to do that. Curious Herd. Karuga the Macro Sage, which I don't think is a big one either. Bonders Enclave, Foil Rare. Cavern Whisperer. Insatiable Hemophage. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. It's, I, again, I cannot understate to you how much I love the alternate comic booky style art here. Rogrin Triome, great. Another Triome. Oh, and there's the foil version, the one we just got. So, Rogrin Triome, eight bucks. Now the Destoroya is already on the the app here. Let's let's make it the full version. It's six dollars. Wow, big difference. Majestic something or another. There we go. X wait, Trium goes in this pot. I don't know. I really don't know, you guys. Just look at the cards. Kraken token. Let me guess a human on the other side? Let's see. Yes! How did I know? Hampering Snare, Thwart the Enemy, and a Tidal Barracuda. Dun, 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 dun. Song of Creation in the extended showcase version. Uh, let's see if that's anything. It is something. Yeah, six bucks there. Cub Warden, a Vulpakeet, Auspicious Starix, Snapdax, Apex of the Hunt. There's a cool alternate um, version and a Godzilla. Which is a Zalortha. Awesome. Very cool. Very cool pack right here. Snapdex. Apex of the Hunt. Showcase. 
kaiju version, non-foil. It's a certain amount of money that it won't show me. Maybe it'll catch up. Godzilla, King of Monsters. All right, I'm gonna have to like switch to off of my Wi-Fi. It's it's so good. It's got an error. Let's see. It was cannot be shown. All right, well, whatever. You guys, tell me down below. Look that up. Um, and a cavern whisper and foil. I, I'm loving these packs. Awesome, actually. Uh, if I was any more organized, then I might know what I'm doing here. But I'm not. There's a gloom pangolin. Look at the gloomy pangolin. Hmm. Hmm. A Capricopian. <laughs> That's funny. Mythos of Brakos in the extended border. Probably just a little bit. Titan's Nest. A Lord Dracus. 231. Volpakeet. Sea Dasher Octopus is a good card. And I like. I like the art on this. Very kind of just understated, but yeah, the yellow stands out in the ocean there. And the showcase version is three bucks. Godzilla Primeval Champion and a Glowstone Recluse. So the Godzilla card is an uncommon version of Titanoth Rex. It's a little bit, 350. And I know it's it was the foil version, it's probably more than that. So fix all my pricing down below, would you? Cat token and a human on the other side. What did I what did I tell you? What did I tell you? Wilt. Ravenous? Gigantotherium. Say that five times fast. Unpredictable cyclone. It's the most unpredictable kind of cyclone. It's so unpredictable that you get another one. You get a foil one right next to it. Let's see. So buck fifty for the regular. And the foil is like three bucks. So there you go. Migratory Great Horn, a Pouncing Shore Shark. I love these alternates. Gem Razor, have I mentioned that before? And Gigan, Cyberclaw, Terror, and a Porky Parrot. That guy's great. Absolutely great. Gem Razor as an alternate. It's just a bug. It's amazing how kind of low dollar these are. Even even being awesome. Well, that was good. Fourteen ninety eight for Gigan, Cyberclaw, Terror. That's great. Just uh. You know, it's the demand will either catch up to these and um, drive some pricing up or not, you know? It's one of those two things. It will either do it or it won't. Agitator Ant and a Ruinous Ultimatum. Cub Warden, Boneyard Lurker, a Zagoth Triumph. I, didn't, I don't think I got a foil Triumph yet. And a Godzilla Doom Inevitable. When I first saw this card, I was like, is that his lower jaw? No, he's got, does he have two jaws? No. It's like some kind of skeletal carapace. Zagoth Triome. Yep, nine bucks just on its own. Gozira, twelve fifty. The Doom Inevitable. All right, last pack for this one. Later up next week, I'll have uh, boxes for patrons. Um, all the patron rewards videos. Um, but I've got this one in kind of early. So here we go for the weekend. Manascape Refractor, Rael the Everwise as a um, extended border. Yeah, 14 bucks there. Rogren Triumph, just a foil version of the regular. It is so awesome that the scanner can't catch it. So maybe it's 10 bucks or so. An Oricorn, a Dirge Bat. Hey, that's cool art too. And King Caesar in foil and a Dreamtail Heron. That closes it out. So. All told, uh, that amount is more than what I paid for this box, so that's great. Um, probably missed a lot of stuff, and maybe I'll be able to at least make my money back on this one. Got more to come. Check me out next week for all the patron rewards stuff. Make sure to like and subscribe and comment down below and whatnot. Catch you later.